expand your belief to include this the Holy Ghost is God Holy Ghost in the God earth in the today. Earth today and you walk with him by Holy saying Ghost words God in the earth my name today. is Andrew Hemstrott thank you for joining us the if is this is your first time fun. here make sure Jesus you subscribe right. if this isn't your first time here and these messages Holy are blessing Ghost you God in the then consider today. becoming a partner with us there is a glory in the spoken word of god you just don't know it yet or if you know some of it you don't know the fullness of it because it's ever expanding you go from one glory to another glory and even if you've been confessing a certain scripture it will expand to where it literally develops into something completely different you didn't even know what it was mm -hmm. when you started confessing it and this glory that you find by saying say by saying, by saying takes you from one glory to another glory you find this glory by saying it by saying the word and it that glory takes you from one glory to the next glory some of us need to go all the way in fact must go all the way in this room of Holy Ghost worship what do I mean by that you use the words I worship you Holy Ghost and you enter into a place of Holy Ghost worship in this room which I've preached on many many times you understand in this room you must go all the way it beckons you and it requires of you to go on from one to the next say from one, from one. To, the next. to the next and it takes you into all things say all things, all things. and no one dares think this way having all things but yet we have scriptures that say this first corinthians chapter 3 and verse 21 therefore let no man glory in men for all things are yours is that in your bible yes, it is. how many things? All, all things all things are yours look at this verse 22 whether paul or apollos or cephas or what does that say mm. or the world say the world. the world now did you forget about verse 21 mm. did we already forget that mm. verse 21 all things are yours the world say the world, the world. are we still reading out of the, the same bible yeah. okay the world or life that's pretty good right mm -hmm. or death you can own it or things present say things present. things present see now hey remember verse 21 said all things are yours yeah. things present all things present say all things, all things. Present. Present. present what's that mean now yeah. no when you die and go to heaven no now all things now say all things, all things. Now, now are mine, are mine. very few dare to go here but someone must we must those who are in the room of holy ghost worship must go here mm -hmm. listen to me you must go here the world or life or death or things present or things to come all are yours things present mm -hmm. say things present, things present or things to come, things to come. all are mine yes all things are mine yeah. say all things, all things are, mine. are mine but you're not going there all things being yours without saying 
it goes without saying no actually it doesn't it doesn't go without saying it doesn't come to you without saying yeah. Romans chapter 8 verse 28 and we know that all things say all things, all things. now do you remember us talking about all things yeah. how yeah. all things are ours right. here it says and we know that these all things that we were just talking about mm -hmm. work together for good for us yeah. to them that love God the Holy Ghost to them that love God and to them who are the called according to his purpose or I like it better this way to them who call according to his purpose yeah. you have to call it that way and what would his purpose be his word is his purpose so we're calling things according to his word and when we do that listen all things begin to work together for good for you oh how can you believe that because I believe this someone has to just because you aren't doesn't mean I'm not going to and I will have listen I will have all things being mine and working together for good for me because I call them according to his purpose and all things work together for good for them them who them who call it's all in here worshiping the Holy Ghost and speaking in agreement with his word it's all in here say it's all, it's all in, here. in here creation itself begins to serve you in here can you hear that yeah. Romans chapter 8 verse 21 because the creature itself or creation itself mm -hmm. say creation itself, creation itself shall also be delivered from the bondage of corruption into what the glorious liberty of the children of God that means the glorious liberty that you begin to walk in that we've found in this room of Holy Ghost worship mm -hmm. creation itself will be delivered into that say into, into that. that into what into the glorious liberty that you walk in creation itself will be delivered into it it will begin serving you say creation itself, creation itself begins, begins serving, me. serving me so few dare to go here it hears your voice into your glorious liberty and I've preached on this many times a new liberty of belief would this be a new belief would this be a new liberty of belief mm -hmm. that creation itself begins to hear your voice and serve you it's a new liberty of belief what could you accomplish with all creation on your side all things say all things. all things does that sound like something we've already talked about mm -hmm. all things are yours mm -hmm. well sadly most will not go here or even dare to go here but we say we we, we go from glory to glory to a glorious liberty that all creation obeys mm -hmm we go from glory to glory they stay at from mm -hmm. they never go to they stay at from yep. so you must at least be okay with leaving some behind jesus said the poor would always be with you mm -hmm. you have to be okay with leaving some behind and understanding they're just not going to go 
and also be okay and glad when others do decide to go with you because this is a big deal mm -hmm. but the body of Christ at large has been unwilling to go certainly here but also hasn't even been willing to go at other glories other levels of glory mm -hmm. let alone all things are yours you see that yep. they have lived and died at not all things being theirs Deuteronomy chapter 28 and then let's look at verse 13 and the Lord shall make thee what's that the head, the head and not the tail mm -hmm. and thou shalt be above only say above only, above only. and not beneath mm -hmm. causing you to be the head and not the tail mm -hmm. above only they only. only here's that word only again above only and not beneath now if you're not above only what are you beneath mm -hmm. beneath something mm -hmm. and here it says because you didn't serve the Lord your God what did Jesus say about serving the Lord your God thou shalt worship mm -hmm. the Lord your God and him only shalt thou serve again the word only Deuteronomy 28 verse 47 because thou servest not the Lord thy God with joyfulness and gladness of heart for the abundance of all things again we're talking about all things you have to serve the Lord your God worship and serve the Lord your God for the abundance of all things mm -hmm. it beckons you in this room all things are yours mm -hmm. are you here because you didn't serve him with joyfulness and gladness of heart for the abundance of all things verse 48 therefore thou shalt serve thine enemies and in want of all things mm -hmm. so because you didn't serve him for the abundance of all things mm -hmm. you end up in want of all things mm -hmm. and lo and behold that's where you see most of the body of Christ oh you just think you're superior no I know I am this is the new man in this new room of Holy Ghost worship capable of fulfilling all they all, all all things spoken Acts chapter 3 verse 21 whom Jesus mm -hmm. the heaven must receive and literally means retain mm -hmm. and some translations say that whom the heaven must receive and retain until the times of restoration of all things say all, all. things Thanks all things which God hath spoken who spoke them the Lord God the Holy Ghost spoke them by the mouth of his holy prophets since the world began so Jesus is not going to return heaven will retain him mm -hmm. until someone on earth fulfills all things spoken say all things spoken all things spoken how do you suppose you are going to fill all things spoken by speaking in agreement with them all things all things are yours say all things are mine, all things are mine. see I'm gonna fulfill all these things and then Jesus will be released from heaven and come back if we don't do that then he don't do that Luke 18 8 says when the Son of Man returns will he find faith on the earth when he returns will he find on earth so he's not on earth 
he's returning from heaven to earth and is questioning whether he's going to find faith on the earth what faith this faith that I'm talking about tonight overcomes the world all things first John 5 4 says this is the victory that overcomes the world even our faith oh that doesn't mean the world system if that doesn't mean the world system then he shouldn't even have said anything it does mean this world system it overcomes it meaning it goes beyond it it makes you the head and not the tail mm -hmm. above only and not beneath of what mm -hmm. well not the world system see that's just your religious belief trying to keep you out of where you're supposed to go that's why I said few will dare believe this mm -hmm. say dare, dare believe it mm -hmm. and Jesus said will I find this faith on the earth when he returns it does mean this world system overcoming this world system those who say they can't can't those who say they can can mm -hmm. those who say they can't you've been associating with for years yeah. surely you don't mean the world system the economy the government mm. of course you do realize that yeah. all the promises are yes and amen unless you don't have the right government system and you don't have the right is that what he said no. your faith supersedes it is over it it overcomes it makes you the head not the tail regardless say regardless, regardless. oh surely you don't mean the worldly system you're right you can't you said you can't and you can't but someone will or this won't end are you still there in, in Acts Acts chapter 3 verse 21 Jesus whom the heavens must receive and retain until the times of the restoration of all things spoken which God hath spoken mm -hmm. we fulfill all things spoken they all things spoken, all things spoken. and the doom and gloom prophets can just go to the back mm -hmm. I don't even want to hear it anymore do not pass go do not collect two hundred dollars <laughs> Daniel chapter 7 and verse 26 but the judgment shall sit meaning this it's been decided and they shall take away his dominion yep. to consume and to destroy it unto the end but the judgment shall sit say the judgment, the judgment. now John chapter 16 and verse 8 when he is come talking about the Holy Ghost he shall reprove the world say the world the world, the world of sin and of righteousness and of judgment who will do this the Holy Ghost when he is come has he come yes. the Holy Ghost is here right now we're walking with him and it says he will reprove the world of sin and of righteousness and of judgment who's gonna do this the Holy Ghost when he is come let's read it again and the judgment shall sit verse 27 and the kingdom and dominion and greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven where would that be on earth shall be given to the people of the saints of the most high whose kingdom is an everlasting kingdom and all dominions shall serve and obey him verse 28 hitherto is the end of the matter this is where it ends he the Holy Ghost when he is come and you can't handle this I'm telling you you can't handle this unless you are in this room of Holy Ghost worship let's read it again the judgment shall sit 
and they shall take away his dominion to consume and destroy it unto the end so this is going to happen unto the end verse 27 and the kingdom and the dominion the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven Have you ever heard this the glory of the Lord shall cover the earth under the whole heaven shall be given to the tail and not the head no. below and not above mm -hmm. no to him making you above only and not beneath all things are yours so many people don't dare go here but someone has to who has to here it says the kingdom dominion greatness under the whole heaven shall be given to the people of the saints of the most high God who's the most high God in the earth today Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost he's the only God in the earth today so he must be the most high one because yeah. he's the only one mm -hmm. these things are going to be given to the people of the saints of the most high God in the earth all things are yours all creation delivered into the glorious liberty of the children of God I don't know about you this sounds like good news yeah. the greatness of the kingdom under the whole heaven shall be given to the people of the Saints of the Most High verse 28 hitherto is the end of the matter this is how it ends it doesn't end with you in a cave waiting for the rapture it ends with you the head and not the tail above only and not beneath all things are yours are you here mm -hmm. hitherto is the end of the matter expand your belief this is the belief Jesus will return to find on the earth expand your belief to include this it doesn't end the way they said it would we go from glory to glory until the earth can't give us anymore and we end up owning it all Holy Ghost I thank you for blessing these people and those who had ears to hear says the Spirit Lord shall begin to progress way beyond where they thought they ever could be and those things will begin to hear your voice and obey you and you will become a different person one capable of owning all things and walking in this glorious liberty thank you holy ghost for it for blessing these people and securing their place in this room in this position in this time that we live in in Jesus name amen. amen if you have a tithe or an offering hold it in your hand say this after me Holy Ghost I worship you I thank you that as I worship you and speak in agreement with your word all things become mine and I walk into them and they come to me in Jesus' name. Amen. The Father is in heaven. Jesus at his right hand. Holy Ghost, your God.